Collections Management is a module in Dynamics GP that assists you in collecting money from your clients. It allows you to focus on those clients that really need your attention. And frankly, it's a module that's not often implemented, and I don't understand why, because it's very easy to use, it's very easy to implement. Let's take a look at it. There are five things I like about this module. Number one, all the information about your customers in one place. It's easy to go to. Number two, I can create queries and really focus on those clients that are giving me a hard time. Number three, I can create notes and save those notes about my information, about my interaction with that particular customer. Number four, I can print multiple invoices easily to easily respond to my customer's request for additional information. And number five, I can print those notes on an aging for my customer so I can see the notes, the interactions I've had with that customer along with the aging for that particular customer or group of customers. To access the module, I'll go to Transactions, Sales, and then the Collection Main Window, which is down here at the bottom. Here's a particular customer. You can see I've got a number of pieces of information about this client. I can go to the Stats tab up here, and I get a familiar window. I can also go to Display all the transactions that are in the aging. And you can see here I've got notifications about notes that are attached to this particular item. I could open that up, see that note. Also, I can look at my unposted sales to anticipate any problems I might have in the future with this particular client. The second thing I like is I can create queries to look at separate groups of clients. Here I've got a query here and I can refresh that query and I can see all the clients that fall into that query. It's really very easy to make a query up. Let's do one right here. I'm going to open up the query window. I'm going to clear this one and create a new one. And I'm going to create a query for over 60 clients. And there's a number of tabs here with information that I can select. I'm going to select the aging periods one, and I'm going to select the aging period 61 days and over. These are my real past due clients. And I'm going to hit query. It's going to go out and query that information. It'll give me stats on that. It automatically fills it in in this particular window. So now as I scro scroll through here, I'll just see clients that meet that criteria. Another thing I like about this module is I can create notes. You can see a number of notes listed here. It's relatively easy to do. I can hit new note here. There's different action IDs that I can set up to categorize my notes. So I'm going to select one here, promise to pay, and just put a note in here. And I can save that note. If I wanted to select some invoices associated with that, I could do that. I can also assign someone else to it. But I'm just going to save that note now and it becomes part of my list here for the notes for this particular client. Also what I can do with this module is I can print multiple invoices. So if a customer calls up and says, you know, I didn't get those invoices, you can easily respond to that request and th send those invoices to them. What I do is I hit print here. And I'm going to print a cover letter. The module also comes with a number of templates for Word documents that you can send out to your client. And you can modify those letters if you want to. And then I'm going to select print invoices and select a number of invoices that my customer said he didn't receive or would like to have resent. So I'm going to select those here and then hit print. I could easily fax those through a fax server or email them. But I'll print them here so that you can see the results. So here's my form letter that comes up. And then the invoices come up as well. So it's an easy way to print out invoices and send them to your customers. And finally, the thing that I like is I can easily print an agent that has these notes in them. So let's do that right now. If I go to Reports, Sales, and then Collection Reports, I have aging accounts with notes. That's the one that I want. And I've already set up some selection criteria, so I'm going to use that and then print that out so you can see what it looks like. So here's my report. I've got all the notes listed at the top here. And then as I scroll down, 
see the actions and then I see the aging right here and this is an easy way to keep on top of your customers to make sure that they're paying you on time collections management is included in the BRL licensing in the advanced management suite if you have the suite and you haven't implemented collections management I really urge you to do so because it's easy to use and it's quite effective